Hey guys, today's video is going to be my Pan That Palette update video. Um, this will be my six month update. Um, sadly, I did not make that much progress this month. was just kind of a trying to figure out where I want to go with the palette. Um, I don't know. I just kept trying different things. And I was just kind of stuck in a rut that I just was not liking the eyeshadow looks that I was coming up with. So my palette kind of suffered from that but I do have some goals for myself here in the next um, month just quickly to recap what um, when I've used up the shadow or not used up I haven't used up any but um, when I hit pan on them I will be looking over here because I have a little paper set up that tells me the months I wrote it down so it's like on my mirror so it's over there so I'm just gonna look over there so the first shadow I hit pan on was um, Virgin, and then I hit pan on Sin next, and then I hit pan on Naked in June, hit pan on Sin in February, hit pan on Sidecar in March, and I hit pan on Toasted in June. Um, so I, I pretty much assumed that these four I was going to hit pan on pretty early on in the project um, because... Those were the products, those were the eyeshadows that had the most progress on them anyway. Um, so the other ones I knew were going to be a bit more difficult for me. Um, and like I normally do with these videos, I will have the pictures from each month from the start till now at the end. Um, and it'll say what month and blah, blah, blah. And you can see my progress. But here is just an overall rundown of my palette. And, um, as you can see, I have almost used up Sin. I was going to wait and just set that aside because I really do like that shadow. And I was just going to wait until school started back so I would have a go-to look. But at this point, I'm just ready to get it done and not have it anymore. I love the shadow and if I used up all of my eyeshadows in my collection, I would definitely go back and purchase a single of it. And I've come to the realization that I would like to also purchase Toasted at some point. If I find a dupe for it or something that's drugstore that works just as well, I might get that, you know, whatever. Or I haven't really looked into it because I have enough eyeshadow to last a lifetime. But if that point ever came, then I would like to get those. Um, so this month I've worn a lot of different eyeshadow looks. Um, I've used Sin on the Lid, Naked in the Crease, and um, Virgin as an inner corner highlight. I've used Sidecar on the Lid, Naked in the Crease, Virgin as an inner corner highlight. I've used Half Baked all over the lid um, with Naked and Buck in the Crease. I've used Half Baked on the Lid, Smog um, on the uh, out, like Half Baked on the inner half smog on the outer half and then naked and buck in the crease and virgin on the inner corner i've used sin on the uh, the sin on the inner half toasted on the outer half and hustle in the outer v and naked in the crease and virgin as the inner corner so i've used and i have used dark horse um in conjunction with half baked smog and dark horse it's kind of similar to the sin toasted and hustle look i just do the same thing um and I've used sidecar if I didn't mention that I haven't used so throughout this challenge I've used every eyeshadow except gunmetal and creep well actually I think I used creep one time um I am I'm gonna try gunmetal and creep together or something with them because I do want to at least use them and try them I've never worn a color like gunmetal on my eyes before who knows what it will look like. I really don't know. But I'm going to wait until towards the end of the project. Just because I know I'm more than likely not going to use it up. Um, and like I said before in my previous videos. That I would prefer as of right now with how this is going. I would just want to hit pan on most of them. I've hit pan on 5 of the 12 shadows. I was hoping I could hit pan on a shadow every month. Which um, I did end up doing if I would have did it this month but like I said I was just struggling with this palette I just don't know where to go like as of right now my goal is to use up sin sometimes virgin I use on I use on the inner corner every day um the 
pan is getting larger on it but there's so much left and sometimes I use it on my face as a highlight but that just depends if I'm feeling that because I am trying to use up Benefit What's Up and that just gets a lot if I put this on top of it so I prefer not to do that but if I don't want to use the cream I will just go ahead and put that on my face naked I've been really focusing my brush up in this top corner up here so hopefully I can see some progress in the next month with that um the eye look I've been doing for about the past week I've been taking an eco tools crease brush and I've been putting it above my crease as like a transition color and then I take buck with a sigma blending brush it's kind of like a flatter tapered one and I put it in my crease and then I put sin on the lid either by itself or with toasted or whatever I want to do and that's pretty much what I've been doing with all my eye looks um, doing the whole naked and buck mixture together so I can start getting showing some progress on buck um, hopefully I can hit pan on buck this on this month in the next month um, depending on what happens with sin which I would say I can use that up it just has really just has shadow on the corners I may have to repress it I don't know how I would do that with it being in this palette that might be a bit too complicated for my skill level of pressing shadows I don't like golds on my eyes so I don't know what to do about half baked because I want to try it now I've tried it and it looks good to an extent when I put it over a darker um like after I blend out my crease and everything, it's not as um, like golden. I don't know. Like it looks good on other people, but I just don't like it on me. Um, so I was mixed. I was putting half baked down and then putting smog on top of it, and that made it a little bit more bronzy, but it still has that gold tone in it that I just don't prefer on myself. Um, and then hustle. I really like the color, and I like it. Like it looks super good in this swatch. Like yeah, that's a great color. But the pigment, when I put it on my eyes, is just not there. And it's so hard to blend out. And I don't know what to do, really. I've just, this month has just been a brick wall. Me hitting a brick wall, pretty much. I'm just like, I don't know what to do. Because after I used up Sin, I could use Toasted and Hustle together. I'm fine with that. But then, just thinking after I use that up. Or, you know, like, if I get tired of that, I don't know where to go. Because... I just don't like golds and yeah and then I feel like that's just super smog is a super dark color and it kind of has like a green tone in it I don't know Ugh, help um so give me any suggestions you have on this on what I should do or um how you make golds work if you don't like golds or anything like that because I need help um so this was probably a little bit longer than my usual um, Pan That Palette update videos, but I just really wanted to show you all exactly what was going through my head about this palette, and hopefully I can get some suggestions about what I can do to hopefully reach some goals um, in the next month and throughout the rest of the year. So um, even though I didn't make progress, I'm hoping that I can surpass my little stopping point that I had this month and make some progress. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and like I said, please leave any suggestions you have for this palette. Good luck on any of your um, projects or challenges that you're doing at the moment and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye!